to go. You got to come in. Here's the little switch there. I'll pull this back. There we go. Oh, we're still adjusting here. Hi, everyone. It's Diana again. And Steph. Uh, make and take Monday. How are you guys doing? This is gorgeous outside. It's hard to be inside. A um, couple things we want to talk to you about. We have a big class coming up next Saturday. I can't yep. believe it. She said, I'm like, oh, it's already then. Um, Friday night is available for any of you that are on our team already and want to just kind of hear more about Young Living and um, Team Build. Or if you're interested in joining us, let us know about that. We haven't got the details um, finalized for that yet, but we um, have that at option. We have Upline coming into town. We're really, really excited. Saturday's class is... Gosh, now is it 9.30 at the St. Croix Falls Public Library? I'll confirm that, um, but it is on events here. If you haven't been invited, let us know. Um, we will add you. Um, we are really, really excited about about that. We've got um, them coming. We're going to do some, they'll do some hands-on where we're going to have some hot rocks and uh, hot towels, um, work with the oils on our feet, reflexology. Um, I'm not sure. We might have some skin care. We have some basic oils, just great information about products and stuff that we've got going. The Ninja Bar will be there. We'll mm -hmm. do some um, some um, snacks, I'm sure, and um, everyone will go home with a gift again. So we are really looking forward to it. Let us know so we make sure we have enough space for you. Um, we wanted to get a bigger room, but the library has... They're a little limited, but we'll yeah. make room if you say you're coming and we want to make sure we have enough gifts for you. So it's Make and Take Monday, and um, we're going to make some foaming hand soap. And you can't believe how easy this is. So I got a bottle. You can buy them. You can reuse. And I'm um, just going to fill this up. Oh, I never grabbed a measuring spoon. Do you need a measuring spoon? I can yeah. Know. Or we can kind of guess, too. We're going to start with just three tablespoons of the Bronner's. Um, Castile soap. I like the hemp baby unscented. And we're just going to add that. Sorry. Thanks, Steph. One. Two. Oh, that's two. Oh, that was two. So we've got four. <laughs> Sorry. Soapy. <laughs> And I like to add a little vitamin E, which helps your hands. So it said three drops. So we're just going to go one, two, three. Seeing we're doing everything in extravagant, I must well add a little extra. <laughs> okay, we were trying to say there's lots of different um, recipes you can make, and we just decided some fun summer ones. I'm going to do the LLP, we call it. It is, um, and you just do six drops of oil. So I'm going to do two of the lemon. Come on. And then two of the lavender. That one comes out. Now I get a little a third one. That's okay. And two of the peppermint. Oops. Spilled some. And then you just top it all off with some distilled water. I probably could have given it a little swirl first. Do you swirl yours every time you use it or not really? Um, um, depends. Like during the day, usually in the morning, then I'm in there so many times. Mm -hmm. And if you look at that, some really nice soap. Extra foamy and extra soapy. And it really smells good. And it feels good and it washes feels, off. Yeah, it feels, I mean, it's really Maybe. nice. Mm -hmm. So there, there's the soap. That's the easy peasy one. Yep. And then we've got, you could do um, any oh, combination. Sorry, sorry. These oils were in the kit, so I picked them and that because it's a personal favorite of ours. But, you know, uh, fun like, summer ones. Yeah, like an orange and a peppermint, yeah. like she used. Otherwise, kind of a mojito feel. Mm -hmm. Lime and peppermint. Yummy, yummy. Lots of options. So many options. We just kind of picked some that came with the soup, like you said. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. I'm going to rinse my hands. Sure. Next up, we have the Thieves Cleaner. So this one... Um, this one is actually $22 for this container, and you're thinking, whoa, oh my gosh, $22, that's a lot of money for this 14.4 mil, or sorry, fluid ounces of this product, but I mean, I've had this for months. Yeah. I mean, I, I this is all I use for my countertops, um, cleaning, bathrooms, mirrors, windows, everything. Mm -hmm. So it's essentially one cap full of this into this size of a bottle. Otherwise, I do have a smaller bottle. But I usually, like Diana does, I put the water in first to 
this one just because uh, it'll usually foam up, right? When you do yeah, yours, yeah. When I when I do over. mine, it foams, so it's like, well, I want to get every little speck of the thieves cleaner in there. Mm -hmm. I just cleaned our lawn chairs outside with it yesterday, and it did a really good job. Oh, did you? Mm hmm Put it on, let it soak just a little bit. And I should just leave a little bit of space. Yep. I know it's just a tiny little cap and Hopefully I can get it in. Do you? I don't I don't have a little... No. Are you going to do it? Yeah. So I'll we'll try. Might Go spell. ahead. Yeah. We'll, do, we'll just... I forgot my little... Funnel? Oh, no. We both had busy days today. This will be interesting. Yeah, you... <laughs> I don't know that I want to do it. Do you want me to get um, a funnel? That's fine. I'll just do it. I spilled oh. some. That's all right. Paper towel. Dang so it. that's what happens sometimes if you're on the fly. That's all right. How this you is real. To... This is real life. Yeah. <laughs> so then as you can see, then you can just kind of, I do a little onesie twosie. This one's, you know, then it's done, ready to rock. You can just, I don't know if I need to really do that, but it, Ooh. Takes a little bit to get all the way up there. I have a bottle in every room in the house. So do I. Yeah, it's crazy. My bathroom. It's crazy. It's just... I only have two bathrooms, so. <laughs> Inside joke. <laughs> I only have two bathrooms. I only need two for the two bathrooms yeah. and one for the kitchen. Yeah. Just to be clear. In any case anyone's wondering, we have two bathrooms at this facility. <laughs> no more than that. Okay, and then uh, we're going to do one more product that's not really a uh, Young Living product, however. It's something fun for summer. I exactly. enjoy it. I'm really trying to drink no soda, which is hard, but I've, n I've been Diet Coke free since when we went whenever that April, whatever. So for sure, a love weeks. yourself enough, mm -hmm. event. She's done really good. And I'm a, di I'm a Diet Coke fanatic. Um, so Malibu, Diet Coke, and our friend... The lime. So you put the lime in the coconut, right? So um, we thought this was like a fun little summer treat mm -hmm. to do with the oils. It's even just good, just plain yeah. lime and Diet Coke. Or if you're really being good, it's really good in water. Just really, yeah, it's my go-to for water. And Megan, I know, can attest, I told her about it, and she said that's her new favorite. Yeah, I really like it. Lime a and lot. water is a lot. so fresh. Yeah. I love it. Um, it's also good in a beer, too. <laughs> We're not even going to go there. Okay. Yes, so those are our... Make and take yep. Monday products this week. Um, we want to share on some new products that we both got. Yes, we're so excited. So, I don't we, know if you saw our neither post. Neither of us have opened ours yet. Yeah, this is real. So, this is Coconut Lime Replenishing Body Butter. The stuff we got to smell and taste, taste, mm. try at, uh, yep, love yourself oh. enough. The smell mm. is undeniable. Like, it's yeah. so smooth, so creamy, not greasy. No. It's delectable. Nice. Seriously, worth every penny. Um, I was waiting to show, and so were you. You know, it's like, <laughs> yeah. you can't get enough. Yeah, it is like really beach in a bottle. Mm -hmm. And it's good for your skin. So oh, they, yeah. this is new and product been... just came out. They just displayed at the rally. Yep. The Love Yourself Enough rally. Oh, this can be really nice. Especially after I've been outside a lot already. And oh, it smells so good. It'll be really good. They used to have a different company used to make this. And when Mike and I got married, I used to pick out a scent for every kind of event. So whether it was like Christmas time or fall or spring or birthday, I would have like a new, like strawberry champagne was one of my favorites. They had this lime and coconut. That's what I used for our wedding. But now I don't have to be with nasty, yucky stuff. Next up... Sweet stress away balls, bath balls. You can make and take your own, or if you're like me, you can be lazy and just order them. I'm or, okay admitting it. Not lazy. We make some things. So oh, we're just busy. Seriously? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I wish. Oh, I wish it's could... like seriously a bottle of stress away. So you get four of them in here. There is a little Young Living put out a little video I watched the other day. We'll post it to our page here. They put it in the water and how much it foams up. You guys. Oh, my goodness. It is, like, ridiculous. Seriously? Maybe happy Mother's Day to you. And I'm, yeah, I'm just. Oh, so good. It's, like, infectious. Oh, my goodness. Is it not? That is really, that, that smells amazing. That smells better even than the stress way. There's something almost. Yeah, like what is, I, okay, so it's. It's like the fizzy. Oh, goodness. I don't even know. So there is. Balsam copaiba in it. There's mm. sweet almond. There's lime, cedarwood, vanilla, oaktea, and lavender. So it is just, I think it's stressed away. It's the same. 
I have no idea. Oh, that's oh, good. Coconut oil mixed with it. I bet that's maybe what it that's is. what it is. Oh, these my are goodness. so good. It's I can't really... wait to use. Oh use, yeah. Use, use. Mm. Anyway, so we we'll move on. Obsessed. Yes. Hashtag obsessed with those. Okay. Next up, what we're gonna talk. Just about. gonna talk a little bit about next week. Okay. So Friday night is the business builder, right? Right. right. So Friday night at the library. Again, this is it's just depends. We're still working out the details because we don't know who's going to be there. I mean, I'm going to be there, you're going to be there, and mm -hmm. their upline's coming. But we we want to know who else, so we know if we need a bigger place or whatever. We're going to get set up for Saturday. Hopefully, they usually let us in early. So, yep. um, both um, you know, but Saturday, please come seriously. We have fun teaching, but they are going to do an amazing job. I can't wait. I can't wait. So, Oh, hi, Owen. Hi, Owen. Hi, Owen. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, Saturday will be really good. Even if you've been to a class, we, we want you to keep coming because we, we keep learning. So, and then this one will be a really good one. Um, are we trying to do a make and take Monday? Next week? Yes. Yeah, we're going to do it, right? We're going to do make yes. and take Monday? Yeah. Yep. And then we're, we thought we'd maybe do some um, product knowledge. If there's something you want to learn about um, or even just more information about how we use an oil. I had a friend say that one of the oils in the starter kit she'd never used. And I was like, Ooh, boy, um, I use that every day. <laughs> I if use you don't that... know how to use peppermint or want to know more, just comment in the video or yeah. on our page. Let us know kind of for the next week's coming. I mean, we have lots of make and take ideas. Right. We just want to know what you guys want to learn, what you want to know, if there's a specific oil. Diana, between the two of us, she has way more oils than me, but we can figure out showing, smelling, how to use, um, yep. incorporating them into your lives. So we try and incorporate it into the foods that we eat, right. stuff that we drink, whether it's alcohol or not. Um, what else? Makeup. Yeah, stuff. I mean everything. The stuff we've got a lot of ideas. We do have a recipe we thought about trying about with the sun, um, the sunscreen mm -hmm. or skin protection for summer. We could make that. We just want to know what you want. Do you want to talk about um, supplements? Do you want to talk um, just individual oils? You know, do you want us just to break them down more? We want to do what you need us to do. Um, right. You know, and just even simple things like, do you know that you know not to touch this part here? Do you know as Steph showed in a, I think a video or something yeah, about. Was there's a little hole there's a hole in the center is not where the oil comes out that's where the air comes in mm -hmm. but there's a little hole if you want to refill or make a bottle to share you take it off you don't touch this but here's another trick for those of us after you get it on you make sure double check and <laughs> also there's a few of them that stick while you don't touch this there's a lot of oil here I don't know if you can see it's, yeah, pretty, it's pretty wet. Yep. It's pretty wet. Mm -hmm. So then you can apply it wherever you want. Um, yeah, that's so kind of a trick it. of the trade. So I have rose oil. It's very expensive. It's very expensive. <laughs> and so it, in it, it uh, what is it? Not liquefies, kind of not crystallizes, but kind of gets more of a solidy. Yep. So you have to warm it up in between your hands. And then, yeah, I kind of like do a little shaky shake, not even a whole drop. And then I take that side like Diana did and I rub it. Take every bit of it. Every bit of it. So yep. that's, I'm kind of. A spaz with that too because mm -hmm. there's a lot there's a lot of drops there is a lot of drops you know? but you know why not get every little bit mm -hmm. so if you're putting it on someone else or something else or diffusing then I usually take a little little bit for me too yep so um I think is that about so, it yep yep do we I gotta rush home she's got ball practice for Maddie we're busy but we just wanted to t t um, touch base okay. and again if you guys have any questions really consider Saturday it's going to be worth it. And we'll see you again Monday and probably remind you again. Yep. And you can invite people and bring friends. So. Mm -hmm, you definitely can. Yeah. And, you know, just we'll say again, too, comfy clothes. We're going to be on the floor. Um, and yoga we just, mat. Yoga mat if you haven't. But we just want to make sure we have enough um, stuff for everyone. So let us know if you're coming. Thanks, guys. We'll see you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.